Hey friends, welcome back. Oh, guys, it has been a long, busy, but very fulfilling day today. It's Sunday. Uh, well, let me start off, rewind. If you're new here, my name is Amber and welcome to my channel. Welcome to my life and welcome to my family. If you're not new here, you guys already know, it's Sunday. Sunday means food bank day. All right, we're back. We got some really great items. Uh, I think all of you will agree when you see what we received, that we received super awesome stuff, great help. I've already got some meals planned out in my brain. And it's like, I'm excited for this week to see what we're gonna cook up. Um, snacks, we're set on snacks. I will be freezing a lot of the items I did get because guys, if you didn't know, bakery items like uh, muffins, breads, uh, croissants, those are all freezable. Is that a word, freezable? Well, it is in my word. In my in my book, it's, it's a word. If, it, if it's not a word, it's a word. They're all freezable. You can freeze them. They last a lot longer. Look, Josh is back and he got another egg. Um, but guys, we got some really great items. Now, if you're new to the whole food bank thing, I am one of those that will tell you, you don't have to be homeless or jobless. Um, you don't have to, you know, you can be like me and my husband. We own our home. Well, we're working on owning our home. We have a mortgage. We have a truck payment. We both work. We have children. We have bills. We have animals. We have life. And life right now is tough. It's tough for you. It's tough for me. It's tough for our neighbors, our elderly. It's tough for everyone. Guys, there's resources out there. Food pantries, food banks, food giveaways, food trucks, pop-up markets, they're out there. They're there for you, for me, for our neighbors. Go, go see what's out there. It can help you just as much as it helps us. It allows us to not stress about, what are we gonna eat this week? I go to two food banks a week, one on Wednesday, gives me primarily produce. I do get other items from that one, but I typically receive an abundance of produce. And when I say an abundance, I mean an abundance that I can and I preserve it because I can't go through 50 pounds of beets in one week before they go bad. So I can them and I have a year's worth of pickled beets on my shelf, or I have a year's worth of carrots on my shelf. The one I go to on Sundays typically provides my family with the bread items, the sweets and treats that you know you can't afford in the store because you're barely getting by, so those are extras that you're not buying. So we get those, and meats. It helps me out with providing the meats as well. And then some odds and ends uh, pantry staples. This allows me to be able to go into the store and buy the things that I may not be getting, such as milk, creamer for my milk, or creamer for my coffee, coffee to drink, which some people may say is an extra in life, Yes, if I had to cut it out, I would. But I utilize our food pantry, which allows me to be able to buy my coffee, buy my dog food, buy cat food. Do I buy expensive cat food and dog food? No, we buy frugal. We buy what's affordable. Our animals, um, it's not like your lowest quality, but they're happy. They're happy, they're healthy. Um, my chickens, free range. They eat bugs, they eat grass, they eat household scraps. Guys, I'm rambling on, but just know the food pantry is there. Look at my description box. There's some links there that, you know, will help you out. Also, for those of you that watched my last video and have asked several questions, you know, as far as Hannah's birthday coming up, my PO box is down below again. If you would like to send her a birthday card, she turns 18 on November the 3rd cards would be a blessing i'm not asking for a gift of any sort just some cards to you know help make this day a super exciting day for her i mean you turn 18 once it's a big milestone um so yes and i have had several people ask do i have a buy me a coffee link i do i quit putting it in my video uh description box because i did not want people to think that i was asking for a handout or begging that's not me that's not me at all. 
I utilize my resources smartly. I don't love, like, you know, I don't expect anyone else to give me items um, or give me money, this and that. That's just not me. Grateful for everything I do receive though. Uh, so thank you, but I will uh, put it in the description box because there are some people that have asked. So in the description box, I will have my go buy me a coffee link. You're not really buying me a coffee. You're just donating towards me, like uh, the channel basically um, is to help, I guess, support. I mean, it's just like this channel. This channel, every video you guys watch supports me and my family. So enough rambling on guys. Well, before I turn you around though, I do want to show you, this is the food pantry that you get to shop at and pick your items. Amongst those, when you're done shopping for your food, you go outside and there's a bonus section with some like odd and in household stuff. Guys, I hit the jackpot today. And when I say super ecstatic, I'll just show you, check it out. Do you guys see this? Are you looking at what I'm looking at? This is a amber colored oil lantern. I have been looking and searching for an affordable oil lantern for a long time. I can't afford what these resellers are wanting. Um, but guys, I got one now and super ecstatic, wonderful, beautiful. Um, we have it. Let me set it down so it doesn't get broke. Now, I grabbed this guy for my daughter. She is a stuffed animal fanatic and this is a really big, really big elephant. So I grabbed that for her. And you guys know that I go for the vintage look in my kitchen. Check out this wooden box, the El Sol fruit and vegetable box. You could tell at some point or another, this was in like a consignment shop and somebody was trying to sell it. But ultimately it got donated. Now, I don't have them in here, but I did also grab, they had some shelves, not tall shelving, but like little, let's see here, little short shelving. Um, I grabbed them. Why? Because I can, and I needed some shelves to put my canned food on. So I did grab that. So that alone, super awesome, really amazing to get. Now guys, y'all wanna see what we received food wise? Get you turned around. Guys, just look at all that beautiful food, okay? All right, this was not from there. This is mine. All right, back here, we have another beautiful two bags of bagels. We've been getting bagels every time. Super handy for breakfast in the morning. I mean, there's five in there. Like, so there's 10 bagels, really awesome. This, Josh grabbed this bread. He said that he really loves when I make garlic toast or grilled cheese with it. So I gra he grabbed that. He also grabbed the pack of street tacos. Super awesome. I grabbed these because I can do like a roast beef and cheddar slider on them. And I grabbed the brown bread little mini loaves. I feel like these are great with meals with just butter, but they also I think would make a really good slider um, like mini sub, mini hot roll. We have a can of pork and beans. And I grabbed, Josh grabbed the pork and beans. I grabbed this three pack of tuna. Really awesome to get. Back here, we have a hot or cold Asian sweet ginger. It's like a um, noodle kit. So we have that right there. Pretty awesome to get. We have two yellow squash, a massive zucchini guys. And I did grab a small eggplant. I've never been one to like eggplant, but I have had someone tell me, try it again, do eggplant Parmesan, you will probably like it. So I grabbed one small eggplant to give it one more try. We have some Alani protein bars. These are the Rocky Road. I grabbed the Rocky Road. Josh grabbed peanut butter and jelly. All right. I grabbed the Kraft Mac and Cheese. I guess Josh did not grab the Mac and Cheese off of that shelf, which is fine. Um, they have this one shelf where it's everybody gets one of each item, which these were on that shelf because everybody was to grab one box of Mac and Cheese, but I did not see one in his box. Oh, the, 
the girl that was helping him uh, must have been confused and told him no. Because these two right here were on the same shelf. Each one had a one. So you got one of these and one of those. Um, but we have the mac and cheese. We have sweet and salty. Josh picked that. He likes his granola bars, which is awesome because it's a nice, quick, easy snack for him. I grabbed the garden rotini because you can never have enough pasta on hand. Back here, what do we have? Honey wing cold. So here's six count of your cold hot wings, but they're not hot. They're not spicy. And then we have four count chicken tenders. I like to get these. I repackage them and I freeze them. On nights, you guys have seen when I'm making something that Katie, my youngest, which is picky, doesn't eat. I can heat those up in the air fryer and she's got dinner with us. So really awesome. Now, we each got to pick out three packs of meat. Let's see here. Josh picked out black forest ham, cherry wood ham, and one of these roast beef. I picked out three packs of roast beef. You guys already know why I picked roast beef. We enjoy mock Arby's at home. So we enjoy doing roast beef and cheddar sliders at home. So there's that. One pack of these little small tomatoes. Now when it comes to the produce, it's a little more difficult to say who got what because you basically are filling a bag. So Josh, I know I grabbed these. Um, he did not. But we both filled our own bag. Just like I grabbed that, he did not. I grabbed that, he did not. He grabbed two of these. We also have a ham and cheese slider. Josh grabbed that out of the deli thing. Not that deli thing, but there was a second deli basket. I grabbed the fresh mozzarella marinated balls. My daughter, oldest one, Hannah, the one that's turning 18, loves this cheese right here. She eats it just by itself. We each got a pound of ground beef. We have six apples, four big tomatoes, three corn, two of these snap peas. This is a broccoli cauliflower medley. Angel hair coleslaw. So all I gotta do is uh, mix up a dressing and make some coleslaw. One Sprite, one Dr. Pepper, one Kool-Aid Jammers, two Kid Essentials. So again, the one that was helping him must not have known that on the shelf, you each got one, one of these and one of these. She probably thought it was just one for the entire shelf. They did have some really new volunteers there today. And we usually are very patient with that because it is church ran. And sometimes you have new people that have never done this and they're learning so sometimes that happens all right down here i grabbed this four pack of bone-in chicken thighs josh grabbed this stuffed chicken breast that looks very interesting bacon and cheddar cheese pretty awesome we each have a pack of crackers now are y'all ready for the amazing desserts i told you i would be freezing some these are both chocolate croissants, and these are from BJ's, which if you have a Costco or a Sam's Club, BJ's is another bulk store. So we have two chocolate croissants down here. Let me move this one. I did open this on the way home and have a piece of blueberry loaf cake. So we have blueberry and banana nut. I will separate these with like a piece of paper, like parchment paper in between and freeze them. We have a six count, and these are the big muffins, guys, of the cinnamon. And then those are blueberry, but like, that's my hand. That is huge. Over here, chocolate chip cookies and chocolate chip muffins. You guys know Josh eats a muffin every single day of his life. I'm telling you, so. Really awesome stuff, guys. I'm telling you, I've got some really wonderful meal ideas already. I mean, it helps us out. It stretches our budget and allows us to fill bellies in this house. So, I appreciate you guys watching to the end. 
if you need that help, just like I do, uh, help, it's a helping hand up. It's not a handout, it's a hand up. Go to my description box, click on one of those links and see what you can find or send me an email, let me know your location and I'll see what I can find for you. All right guys, until next time, take care of my friends.